like knowing what's at stake on, on tomorrow? Uh, just really, really high attention level from uh, start to finish, from tail end of travel day in Wisconsin up until now, and then up until the point, uh, you know, until tip off. It's just everything is locking, every, every bit of energy and every bit of focus is just on, um, you know, being successful at this, you know, at this particular game. So um, just, you know, emphasis has really been put on the small things that's, uh, you know, real little intangibles that's really going to help us be successful, um, you know, come tomorrow. Yeah, it's the exact same thing, but you obviously gone through some adversity, some ups and downs. Everybody has, you know, with the injuries and all that, mm-hmm. or the losses. But given all that, is are you guys, are you happy to be in this position where you can control your own destiny and you have a shot at least, or is it disappointing that you've left it to this last game, so to speak? Uh, I mean, it could go either way. Uh, earlier, just you know, early in the season where. You know, we probably gave away some games that, as a team, we know we should have won. But, um, you know, at this point, you just, you know, appreciate the fact that you, you know, so much has happened and then you still, like you said, still control your destiny. So you're just appreciative of that, you know, alone. So, you know, at this point, I'm just appreciative that, uh, you know, even though we're down, you know, two of our um, four core guys that, you know, we still competing and, you know, guys are making strides in the right area. So, uh like I said again, it's, you know, we're just really appreciative, and um, you know, we just want to show it tomorrow about how hard we play and how uh, you know locked in we look. You guys have played pretty much two games a week forever, it seems mm-hmm. like, and this week, you know, you get finally get your your rest. And how nice is that? I mean, you guys have locked you and Zach, especially locked some minutes. I mean, how nice is that just to kind of get a chance to relax and breathe for a second? Uh, it was really good, man. You just. In the season, nobody's 100%, you know, fresh. But you know, these days where you can, um, you know, just go into the gym and kind of, you know, casually shoot some free throws, just you know, stay up your legs as much as possible, and uh, you know, you know, regain some of that energy. You know, as much as as much as going by, you know, just try to get, you know, as much as you can out of your body for the next, you know, uh, you know, for the next contest is just great. Um, so the last couple of days we've just been really, you know, being really smart about, you know, how we work and the way we work and the intensity and all that, those things. So, you know, it's, you know, it's a great feeling, now, you know, knowing that you know, we had a few days to rest. So, um, you know, we're just going to leave it all out there tomorrow. Do you feel the minutes catching up to you? Personally, you know. It's a lot of minutes. Yeah, it's a lot of minutes, play. but, you know, I'm not going to complain about it, you know. Uh, that's, you know, that's the team asked me to do. So, you know, I do it. Uh, you know, you just, you just want to push through for your brother. So right now I'm in the stage where uh, it doesn't matter how tired I may be. It's just, you know, just really trying to, you know, fight through it all. And, you know, it doesn't really matter. It's just, you know, everybody's tired. So say you're tired would just, you know, you know, basically a cop-out at this point. And do you, um, being spring break, I mean, is that almost, given the situation you guys are in, is that almost like perfect timing to be on spring break and that you guys could just simply, you don't have to worry about anything but one game? Well, uh, of course, you know, not being able to, or not having to at least, you know, get up and go to class. You know, spring break really helps. Uh, you know, not even just the mo- just more so the morale, the you know, the mood of the team. Not having to, uh, you know, get up and go through four or five hour day classes and stuff like that. So I think it was perfect timing, and um, you know, hopefully we can capitalize on it. And um, you know, our rested legs should you know serve us serve us well tomorrow.